Welcome back everyone to my Manchester United career on FIFA 18. It's the first leg of the Champions League knockout stage. We are here in Paris to take on Paris Saint-Germain and what a challenge that awaits us in today's game. Yes, we've got the slight advantage of being away from home in the first leg, but to ensure that we're using that to its full effect, we need to be grabbing a goal or two here against Unai Emery's side. Yes, we've got Romelu Lukaku who starts today. He is in good form in this season's Champions League so far. He is joint top goal scorer along with the likes of Fernandinho, Robert Lewandowski with five goals to his name. But PSG, are they're, they're going to be such a, a tough test. This is almost a final in itself. I mean, you look at the business that PSG have done over the last two transfer windows. In the summer, they brought in Neymar, Mbappe. In January, they spent 91 million on Asensio, who starts on the bench today. And along with that, they've got Di Maria, Cavani, Verratti, Motta. It's going to be a tough game. And look at that defence. Silva, Vertonghen, Dani Alves. Wow. PSG are the sort of team that, that need to be treated as real contenders for the Champions League title. Then you look at United's side. I've gone with De Gea in goal. We've got Jones, Bayi, Valencia and Darmian at the back. Matic, Herrera and Pogba in central midfield. And going forwards, Anthony Martial, Lukaku and Henrik Mkhitaryan. That's possibly the strongest side I can select. We certainly need to be at our very best here today. Already PSG are on the attack. They're looking for that first goal. Looking to settle things here in this first leg of the Champions League knockout stage. Here is Angel Di Maria now, pulls it back, is looking to cross it and he's lost the ball to Martial. We might be able to dig our way out of this corner that we've been backed into. There we go, that should settle things. Here is Neymar now, we need to be so careful of him. Valencia did block the initial pass, but look at this now, Neymar and Cavani, 1-2, one, 1-2, two, one, two. back and forth. Valencia back in position, but it's on for Neymar, who almost found a way through, can we? Matic just getting in the way, breaking up the play is what we want. This first 10, 15 minutes has been so difficult, so testing of our back four. And Valencia can win this back, he does off Neymar. Well done. And again, here is Verratti. Oh, that, it's going to be a free kick to PSG. Matic with the challenge on Verratti. Are they going to take it short? They do. Take it quickly. And it's Cavani who has a shot, it hits the post. And they were so close, Di Maria still on the ball here can we win this back please Di Maria oh, what is going on there we go no Bayi finds Pogba finally we're out of our penalty area and we can hit PSG on the break it's games like this where it's just so difficult to concentrate on doing co oh Martial's throw here doing commentary as well as oh Mkhitaryan's header saved by Trap. or did that just hit the outside of the post and go out for a goal kick don't think Trap got a touch to it, did he? Nah. We do seem to have settled down now. We've started to grow into this game. Looking okay going forwards. Matic now. Where is Martial? There's no options at the moment. There we go. We'll give it to Herrera. Pogba. Martial's through here. Martial gets the away goal. Who would have thought? Who would have thought that we would find ourselves in the lead here? The way PSG started this game... Coming out, firing on all cylinders. And there we are, Anthony Martial, putting us in the lead, getting that crucial away goal. We desperately needed that as well. And that will certainly settle things even more. And of course, quieten down the ground here, which might allow us to go on and get a second. Can we win this back with Valencia? Almost. Neymar passes it to Mota. Matic, crucial interception there. And how about this? It's Martial. It's th two, three on two. Oh, we've lost it to Thiago Silva. Just wasn't concentrating that. Such an imposing character at the back as well, Silva. I was hoping to try and get past him, but Verratti with a good ball out wide to Neymar. It's Cavani now on the ball. Terrible slide challenge there from Eric Bailly. Poorly timed. And it's Neymar now. Kazawa through to Motta. No, 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 no. Oh, he's in space and he's got that equaliser. They were they were going to score eventually in this game it's better to have them score now than towards the end at least we know what we're working with now that was poor defending for me I, I switched to Matic and it just pulled Matic away from from Motta as you can see Matic is on him and then I switched oh dear that's terrible oh Neymar Valencia's just been all over Neymar look at that intercepting the play again 
Valencia's been brilliant coming up against Neymar so far. Here is Valencia. Mkhitaryan, we can give that one to Matic. Switches it over to his left, hits it. Trap saves. Can Too late for Martial to hit on the rebound. It's crossed in though. Pogba on the volley. No! Oh! Well, for a second there, I thought that was going to find its way into the back of the net. Trap seemed to worry right at the very last second. On the volley, look at the curve on it as well. Should be half time now. Once we can we clear this? We can. And that's going to be another free kick to PSG. The advantage was played. The referee pulling it back. And oh no, it's Neymar to take. It's Neymar territory. Right before the break. Oh, we can make do without this. He's going to make it 2-1 here, isn't he? I can just... I just know it's going to happen. I can feel it. Come on, David De Gea. He has got quite a challenge though, Neymar. To try and get that ball up and over that tall wall. Do have Lukaku in there. We have Pogba. We have Bayi. Steps over and Neymar strikes it straight at the wall. We can clear. Referee, please blow the whistle. There is half time. Valencia burning off Neymar. Burning off Cavani and Danilo. Lukaku over the top. Look at that run from Martial. He's in. He's in. What a start this could be for the second half. And trap saves. It's going to be a corner to United. Here is Daniel Di Maria. Jones is in. Oh, what a challenge that is from Jones. And it's going to be a goal kick. They're making a change. On comes their new sign in Asensio and Ben Arthur for Ferrati and Motta. Opening here for Lukaku. Can he get around Thiago Silva? Almost. Silva in with the challenge, but Lukaku carried on. Has his chance, but it's saved by Trap. Back in, maybe. No. Here come PSG once again. Cavani to Di Maria. Cavani back to Danny Alves. Damian just gets in the way. Sticks his foot in there. Knocking him off his stride. And Neymar in the penalty area that's not where we want him Neymar turns on it Jones is there and Arthur hits it over Woo! why does this have to happen I've just made the sub and Martial's gone down injured I was taking him off anyway and now oh this does not look good he's holding on to that knee he's complaining the referee's called the physios on he's gonna have to come off oh look at the way he landed knee first after that challenge from Vertonghen so it's finished 1-1 here I'll take this I'll take it I'll take this result back to Old Trafford that was decent we d we played really well it was a real tactical battle against PSG they kept feeding the ball out wide to Neymar and he just kept coming up against the wall that is Antonio Valencia they just Neymar couldn't get past him Neymar will forever be in the back pocket of Antonio Valencia it's a performance to forget from uh, from Neymar I did expect more oh geez that is not the news I wanted to be reading after that tough game against PSG. Martial out for three months and that is pretty much him done for the season. He might, There might be a chance he might be back uh, for the final couple of games of the, the Premier League season. We'll have to wait and see. Our new signing Ivan Perisic is set to start in our next game in the FA Cup against Stoke. FA Cup football is back. We are back at Old Trafford to take on Stoke, who we play in the Carabao Cup final in a couple of weeks' time. So, Ivor Perisic, it's his player debut today at the age of 29 in the number seven shirt for Manchester United after signing from Inter Milan for 37.6 mil in January. He's raring to go by the looks of things. And he's not the only player to debut for Manchester United. We also have my Jack Gasanovic in the side in central midfield alongside Ander Herrera and Nemanja Matic. Elsewhere, Timothy fosu gets another start for United. So does Ashley Young and go forwards. Jesse Lingard is out on the right and Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Good strong side, which I hope is enough to ensure a victory here today. Let's go, let's go. Let's hit them on the break here. Try and get Ivan Perisic on the ball as much as possible on his debut. He's looking good at the moment. Feed that through for Ibra. Can we hit this? Can we make it 1-0? Yes, we can! Get in! Off to a flyer. Five minutes on the clock and we're already a goal up against Stoke City through our Swedish hero Zlatan Ibrahimovic. On the score sheet once again, he's uh, scored some important goals. He hasn't scored that many goals this season but they've all been important so far. What does Gasinovic have in his tank? Got plenty of space to run into here. Perisic making the run. We'll give it to him. Perisic now. Nice bit of skill, lovely. It's in for Matic, 
absolutely unforgiving from the Manja Matic. He shook that first time on his left. Such a powerful left foot that he has. And such precision to find the top right-hand corner. 2-0 up with just over 10 minutes played in this game against Stoke. I hope I'm not setting myself up for a, a real big downfall here against Stoke. It's on for Juff. We need to... Uh, that's a good through ball pass, but Young's going to get to it first. That one to uh, De Gea. I meant that. I meant that. De Gea saves. Not even 20 minutes have gone yet. It's just been so full on. It's a good cross into the box from Juf. Oh, took a massive deflection there. Juf promoting's effort. Just, well, he went for the De Canio type volley. And it was Jones that got in the way. It's going to be a corner. Young. Every time I've... Oh, that's brilliant. Through for Jesse Lingard. Every time I've started Young, he's putting a really good performance. Here is Jesse Lingard. Now it's in for Perisic. And he's got his debut goal. His first goal for United on his debut. It's 3-0 now to Manchester United. Surely now the game is well and truly out of sight for Stoke City. And what a header. In off the crossbar as well. Jesse Lingard's cross. Pinpoint. Fantastic finish from Ivan Perisic. It's almost as if he was destined to get on that score sheet today. And he's absolutely loving it. Look at that face. Peters. To uh, to Joe Allen. It's Chufa Motins to Juve. Here is Shakiri. I really did think Shakiri had found the, uh, the top corner there. Thought he made it 3-1. Thought there was a bit of uh, a glimmer of hope there for Stoke for Perisic who's just been non-stop for United on his debut he's done fantastic Gasinovic not so much but he's done well everyone else has played here is Gasinovic now hits it oh I thought he almost got his first goal too here is Perisic now I've just constantly given him the ball and he's dominated this left hand side Matter, can he hit that first time he can and he can find the back of the net also it's 4-0 Manchester United this has to go down as probably one of my best performances I've put in on FIFA 18 so far this year. 4 0 up against Stoke in the FA Cup. Couldn't have asked for a better performance, really. We've been non stop and we've been rewarded for that. And Matter on his weaker foot, too. Could you call it the Perisic effect? I mean, he's been put on that pitch today. He's scored a goal and he's made everyone else around him play superbly, also. Look at that. Hesse. What a ball that is over the top. But Rojo's going to get to it first. Jones clears. Finds Matic. Bags of space. Through the middle for Mata. Ibra on for Jesse Lingard. He's onside. Can he make it five? Yes, he can. Absolutely superb. That is brilliant. And Lingard is right. We have hit all the right notes here today. It's 5-0 against Stoke City. We are certainly going through to the next round of this season's FA Cup what a finish on his, on his left foot as well with the finesse effort finds the bottom corner I kind of feel sorry for Jack Butland Stokes defence just haven't been up to scratch today and Mark Hughes there he is must be questioning what what went wrong where did where did it all go wrong for Stoke I mean 63 minutes gone we're 5-0 up we could probably get another two before this game is finished anyway off goes Perisic to be replaced by uh, Rashford and off goes Gasinovic to be replaced by Fellaini. Our two player debutants done really well. On we fight in this season's FA Cup. It's finished 5-0 here to Manchester United. I really hope Stoke perform like this when we play them next. Which will be at Wembley in the Carabao Cup final. Ivan Perisic, what a start to life at Manchester United. This is his debut. He had one shot, scored one goal. Brilliant start and I'm sure he's going to kick on from there. Anyway guys, that's it for this episode. Hope you've all enjoyed. I'll see you all in the next one.